I want to show you how we can configure Google server site tagging with Pixel Your Site. In this video, I assume that you already have a server tag container. The browser tag will be fired by Pixel Your Site, and this tag will send data to the container. From there, you can um, have any destinations that are supported by the server site tagging. In this video, I will not enter into details about how to configure the container, how to set up everything. I will record separate videos later on, but for now, just the easy part. Assuming that you already have uh, the server side container, go here to admin, settings, container settings, and get this URL, server container URL. That's all you need from here. Again, I assume that you follow all the Google steps and you have this container already created. Go back to Pixel Your Site. Uh, make sure you update a plugin. This is, this is a recent, re recent feature, so uh, if you don't see it, update a plugin. Uh, look for this option, make sure it's enabled, and add the container URL in this field. And that's it. Save. Save. And uh, from this moment, the data will go to the con server container. It's important to remember that the property configured here will not get data. If the same property is configured inside the uh, server container, the data will still go, but through the server container. If you have a diff diff different property configured in the server container, that property will start to get uh, data. And uh, you can confirm it's working by testing your website. Go to Workspace, click Preview, and open your website and start to browse. Basically, fire events, add to cart, visit products, and so on. And here on the Tag Assistant, you will see what data is received by the server container. So you can now confirm that the data is working and events are received by the container. Uh, you can also check inside, if you have a, a Google Analytics configured inside the container, you can check if the Analytics property gets any data. In my case, the container has um, this tag configured this one that I'm opening right now, and it gets data. This data comes from the browser tag installed with Pixel Your Site that goes to the server tag, uh, server container, and from there to Google Analytics. So it's not sent directly from your website to Google Analytics, it goes to the um, server tag container. You can have other destinations, you can have, uh, for example, Meta Conversion API in the container, if you don't want to have it uh, with our native integration, it's up to you. Uh, so now the data, the data works, goes from your website to the container and then to the configured destination. In order for this to work, the container has various um, options that I will explain in a separate video, but just a, a small presentation. You have a client, that is configured to receive the data. In this case, it will receive data from GA4 tags, regardless of what um, ID the GA4 tags uses, but you can change this and, and uh, add a specific measurement ID that has to match the one that is installed with the browser tag. Not the case here. I don't want to do this. This car changes. Uh, we have tags, in my case, Google Analytics, the property that uh, I just showed you that gets, uh, and we have triggers, all um, GA4 events. That's the trigger. I configured this tag following Google documentation. You can find it relatively easily. Search on Google, Google server side tagging fundamentals, skip, the ads and somewhere in the middle of the page there's this link it will open this nice page with all the data that you want all the information that you need 
is very well written just follow the steps and uh, you will be able to make it important what you don't need is a browser container triggering the events because we do this picture your site does this so it's the process is easier when you use picture your site simply have the plugin installed have your google analytics tag add your server site tagging um, url server site tagging url here and that's it events will work and the data will uh, be received by the server side um, by the server container i'm christian sarichesco from pixel site this is our main plugin pixel your site professional make sure you have it uh, up to date and uh, you will see this uh, new option here it's still in beta we plan to add some more features we are still testing some stuff uh, we make we we want to make it fully compatible with for example meta api integration with google tag manager and uh, and so on uh, thank you for watching and uh, like this video share this video and subscribe to our youtube channel